Team Deathmatch. Welcome all, this is Colo5 and this is an update video to the IW4X uh, tutorial I gave uh, a little while ago. Uh, a number of people were having issues um, with getting the bots to work and uh, I, I was experiencing the same thing. And I did a whole lot of stuff last night and the day before to uh, fix it and now I think they've patched and uh, updated everything so you should be able to just download the most current and go to go to town anyway i'll still cover off the stuff um i'll put the links available here because some of the links are difficult to find anyway so as per my video previous video you need to download the x labs to start with i won't drone on this bit too much um if it's the first time you're watching this sort of video you download the main game as well these are all available from the home screen here at the the x labs uh, page um and then you find the bots mod now for most times i've put into google um finding iw4x bots mostly will take you the 2.1 update this 2.3 update is pretty hard to find but yeah i've made this uh link available in the description below so grab that one download it yep and as per previous instructions or just read instructions as you go there's my bots folder um, and i will just uh, highlight here do you want to make sure you got uh, 0.79? And I'll get into that a little bit why that was important. Grab your mods folder and throw it into your main route. Uh, so your main folder of your uh, COD model for two. And then give it a whirl. As seen before, you need to initiate the bots in the menu before you initiate a game and then you've got offline bots so i attempted to recreate the issue that myself and many others were having that script compile error that seemed to be due to due to x labs and due to that modern warfare 2 only being in only being in 0 0.78 um, what i had to do for my instance um, was in this x labs menu here as well as finding the game the root folder i had to put it into experimental and i really wish this labeling was a bit different so that's just uh stable is just the current release version um all happy days all been tested the experimental is in a testing phase like it's the beta um and that put me over to the seven point sorry 0 0.7.9 so you're down to the bottom here, you can see what version of the Modern Warfare 2 you're running. Um, and I tried to test this just um, just a couple of hours ago. Uh, I tried to test stable and stable would give me 0 0.7.90, uh, none of this um, extra stuff here. This extra stuff here would be a beta code um, that's applied to it. Um, but yeah, uh, so you shouldn't have that script compile error. Um, if you've got the most recent version of the Modern Warfare 2 and the most recent X Labs um, launcher, my PC had a perfect time with that arrangement. My computer, on the other hand, didn't. If you do have any issues um, and you need to uh, either it is either crashing out at the X Labs or the game itself, come to this X Labs log here. This will this will to me it does seem a little bit confusing, uh, but it likely will provide you some direction into where you should be going um, with the fixing your errors for me i had an issue with this dll file in my c and release of my app data um, yeah i had to go through a little bit of problem solving i was searching through and like this help here didn't really give me a whole lot i was more confusing than anything so I was really quite at a loss as to what to do here. But when I went to this log file that's automatically generated, you know, this text file here, I was able to, for whatever instances, so this was giving you a description of what's occurring. So yeah, this is, is actually downloading a DLL file here. So yeah, I can't replicate this right now, but the way that I fixed my issue 
that I was missing this DLL file, came here, it provided a link, downloaded it, put it into the file, uh, into the location it was requiring, and it went to town. Yeah, and I know I'm being heavy-handed with this explanation, but most of the times when you boot up Xlabs, it will do an automatic update. Um, I'm a little bit mixed on this. I'd prefer, if I've got a version that works with my computer, I'd rather just let it go. But anyway, so when I booted up that Xlabs on my PC, as I'm saying, it would give me that screen to say what it's currently doing. It's doing an update. Um, it would say one of one files needed to download, and it listed this uh, LIB C F D L L file, and it just would spin. It'd say 30, like 20 seconds left, and DLL files, they're not that big, so it just spun for like minutes, and I was thinking, yeah, what's going on here? Anyway, as I said, problem solving, you know, TLDR, um, just go to your log file. That should be a, a point of call. If not, go to the Discord. Um, definitely don't go with questions to me because I, you know, I'm not a dev. I just like playing these sort of games and mods. Anyway, that'll be it. Thanks all. This has been Colo Five. Take care. Hey, Colo Five here. Just with some post uh, editing uh, commentary here, demonstrating the resistance map from the uh, Modern Warfare Three package. Yeah, sorry, something's going on with the audio. I'm not sure why it's not syncing with the rest of the sound that I recorded earlier. But anyway, this was super fun uh, playing on this map. I really liked the Modern Warfare 3 maps. And this arrangement that I've got set up here uh, with my bots at the moment, uh, I'm like 1v8 at the moment, and there's a limited spawn count, so you can only spawn nine times. Yeah, I didn't mean to... Uh, I was supposed to have some allies. As you saw with that scoreboard, there's... Uh, allies rostered, but they're not spawning for some reason. Um, just a quirk of how I've uh, used that men menu, or inappropriately used that menu. Anyway, super fun, and it got really uh, nail-biting down to the end. But the, yeah, as I said, I, I really like this map. Uh, and yeah, the devs, uh, it seemed to work really well. As per this demonstration, you can see me using kill streaks, uh, using all the de geometry, like jumping up over uh, over obstacles. Ah, uh, yeah, and all the kill streaks. So I, I use a uh, a few of those. And yeah, exactly. Explosions work really well. So I'm not sure if it is uh, an, a, a huge feat to recreate this, or if you just use the assets from other game, the other games. Um, but I'm assuming it's not just a one to one. Yeah, great job to the devs and keep it going, it's awesome. Yes, yeah, so I only have one life now. I've, I've died eight times. And that's a really crappy score, actually. To have 13 kills and only uh, eight, with using eight, eight lives. But this would uh, go pretty much one man army mode. It's all up to you. Yeah, so I get that alert. I'm not really sure why that popped up, unless my allies like despawned or something. Kick in activity. I know it probably won't happen, considering it's a Blizzard, the Blizzard games now, the 2019 um, Modern Warfare and the new Modern Warfare 2. Considering the new Modern Warfare 2 has really crap maps, like well, it's. Not crap, they're just not enough. It really needs to have some more maps. And I know they're like including some of the old ones. It's so upsetting, I have to say this, it's so upsetting that uh, um, that they've included the Modern Warfare 2 2009 maps in like the ground war, ground war modes. I was getting so excited for that, but it's taken ages. Like it should have come out, more maps came out in the, uh, the last season. Uh, and at this time, I think the second season just dropped. I, I, the one with the, the samurai swords and the, the um, bolt. The crossbow thing. Yeah, because like, that included a, um, that array. I don't know, the, the, the sort of desert with uh, a couple of satellite things. Anyway, yeah, so I missed that, that one. But well, yeah, I guess what I'm saying is that uh, I really wanted them to include more maps. So they, yeah, put one of them, a uh, classic map, back in. But then they removed that highway one with all of the cars that it, they exploded. Um, I feel like they ghost removed it. Um, yeah, it needed a bit of rework. People didn't like it. But actually, I loved it. I, I got a he huge success. Oh, 
Oh, and yeah, so this is the second game with uh, my spawns actually going in. So yeah, I'll say this again, that I've got three other teammates. So this makes my team um, a total of four versus eight. And everyone's only got nine spawns. And I go pretty hog wild. Um, yeah, some of the bots, you can tell they uh, use certain parts of the map. And some maps there, yeah, you can exploit them a whole lot. And I definitely feel like I'm doing this in the... Uh, in the flanking move here. But yeah, back to that Modern Warfare 2 um, 2020, 2021, whatever it is. Um, the most recent one. That highway map, I could, I'd could flank so hard on some of those, I got ridiculous kills. I got like a 50 streak, um, not streak, but 50 uh, killed. Yeah, I'm just gonna ham on this. Yeah, so now I realize I'm a little bit overhead, so, and I wanted to use this gunner chopper. And this gunner chopper works really damn well. It's really surprising. Uh, yeah, uh, I don't know how, what goes into this at all, but I'd expect that a game map that didn't have this exact um, kill streak, and I'm trying to work out what, what's going on there. It must have been a UAV. But yeah, really, really damn impressive. Oh, and that's why I really like this mode that I'm using here. It starts off really hectic, but as you start to dwindle down um, a few of the enemies, um, it turns into a little bit of a like search and destroy sort of type thing, where you're really trying to be uh, moving around the map. I'll bring up the scorecard at the moment, I think. Oh no, yeah. Now this person only has one life left. Sorry, two, two lives left. My bad. So they've got seven deaths, meaning they've got two lives left. Yeah, maths. Really lucky on me. I, yeah, don't use that grenade. Oh, and then I alt tab for some weird reason and I get shot. And someone just pistol kills him to finish. Anyway, this was super fun demoing this. Have fun, guys. That was just a quick demo uh, of that resistance map from Modern Warfare 3. Um, as seen here, there is a number of new maps that are put uh, populated within this uh, within this update. Um, oh, so glad it ambushes on there as well. Uh, yeah, and again, great work with these devs, including all this content. This is just excellent.